The University of Massachusetts Minuteman Marching Band was recently promised $4.5 million by UMass as part of its newest five-year capital plan. For many in the marching band, the facilities are desperately needed. Director George Parks' office is located in a building slated for destruction, and the rest of the band currently has to squeeze into the Grinnell Arena, a former livestock arena and slaughterhouse. Well, we're currently in the um, University Apartments. It's a uh, building actually slated for destruction, you know, as soon as they can get us out of here. And uh, we're very excited because we are on a new campaign to get a new building for the band. Construction on and around the site have even limited access to the arena loading dock. Band uniforms, for lack of better facilities, are off campus in self-storage. The current conditions can prove to be a logistical nightmare for current band members. We have to take things from that lovely little shed over there and move it over across the field to the middle of campus um, to load up the buses. After then, we all have to load up the buses and the trucks, and then we have to go to the game, we do our performance, then we have to load everything back onto the trucks. Right now, band members have to cart their equipment however they can, but the new facilities will be located right next to the practice field. Although current band members won't be around for the opening of the facility, they're excited about their new home. We have one big building where everybody can get together and we'll have a place for our uniform storage when people have to bring them home so we won't lose any of our uniforms. We'll have places to store them all. We'll have places to store our instruments. Um, we'll have places for the band members to sit and relax and be here for rehearsals. And it's so exciting to know that people, even though I'm not going to see it, the band's still my family. And I'm really, really excited about the I was working on my handbook and a manual that I'm going to pass down to whoever comes behind me and realizing all the things that are going to be changed for them. And it's so incredibly exciting and I can't wait to come back and see how everything's going to be changed. Financing for the facility will be buttressed by the $4.5 million promised by the university, but more is needed to complete the new facility. Facilities. The band will be kicking off fundraising for the new building on Saturday, October 4th, when the Minutemen face Delaware at McGurk Stadium. For Gazetnet.com, this is S.P. Sullivan.